Are you struggling to rank your tech videos on YouTube despite creating quality content? What if I told you the key to more views and higher ranking lies in choosing the right keyword? Stay tuned because in this video, I'll show you how to find the best keywords for the tech niche that can help your videos rank on YouTube and start driving more traffic to your channel. This is part 2 of the tutorial. To watch part 1, please check our playlist in the tech niche. In the tech niche, competition is fierce. From the latest gadgets to in-depth product reviews, everybody is trying to get their videos seen. The RPM is high, but here is the thing. If you can find high search volume, no competition keywords, you have a much better chance of standing out. In this video, I am going to show you how to uncover these keywords and optimize your content to rank higher. Whether you are reviewing laptops, smart home devices or gaming accessories, I will walk you through how to use tools like VIQ, TubeBuddy and discover the exact keywords your audience are searching for. From detailed tutorial on how to use these tools to specific keyword examples for popular tech products, this video will arm you with the knowledge you need to rank higher. Once you find the right keyword, I'll show you how to implement them in your video title, description and tags to maximize their impact. And don't forget, optimizing for keywords is just the beginning. As your videos start getting views from YouTube search, the algorithm will kick in and start promoting your content through suggested videos and browse features to new people. The first keyword for today is, can the police take my phone without a warrant? It has a search volume of 210 from USA and global search volume of 340. The trend is good that it will, this is a evergreen topic, so it will always have a trend. Let me check it in YouTube search. It has a search volume of 390 as per keywords everywhere. And as I told you, the trend is always there. You can see it here. Let me see how many videos are targeting this keyword. Nobody is targeting this keyword and I will show you. This is all my extensions. So guys, you can go ahead and make a video on this. Let me see it once in VidIQ. VidIQ is also showing a search volume of 2388 and the related keywords are search warrant, Supreme Court, Police, Warrant, Cell Phone. You don't have to make all these uh, things in your video, only talk about whether police can take your phone without a warrant. If you are in tech niche, you don't have to go and uh, optimize your content about Supreme Courts and warrants and Fourth Amendment and lawyers. Just we are targeting the phone and the techn uh, technology niche slowly, slowly. You are gaining momentum on the technology niche, which where the phone is the prime keyword. Now time to move for our second keyword. My second keyword of the day is how long should a cell phone battery last? It has a global volume of 430 and uh, 210 from USA. Trend is good. Let me check it in YouTube search. Keywords everywhere is saying it has a volume of 720 per month. Let me see how many videos are targeting this keyword. Again, there is nobody targeting this keyword. I don't want to show you the extensions again, but I want to just cross check if some other videos means the same thing or not. So our question is, how long should a cell phone battery last? Okay, Why phone batteries don't last long? No, it doesn't say what we are asking for. How long will your phone last? No, it is not saying the same thing. Battery life ex explained. Are you killing your battery by back, back charging? Okay, kind of nearby, but not exactly. Fastest charging phone. Phone batteries be like... No. So nobody is targeting actually this keyword, only I found one which is close to it. I will check it now in VidIQ. It is showing a search volume of 1634 and the related keywords obviously will be battery life, cell phone battery. And all. Go ahead and make a video. This is a very good keyword. Nobody has targeted yet. Let me move to my next keyword. Our next keyword is can you have your phone in rehab? It has a search volume of 210 from USA and global search volume of 300. But look at the CPC. If cost per click is around 11.59, you can expect an RPM of 30 to 40 dollars for this. Let me check it in YouTube search. It is showing a good uh, volume here and the CPC is also showing high. Let me see how many videos are targeting this keyword. So there are few videos which are targeting this keyword. Maybe everybody knows that this has a very high earning potential. However, I think it's only three or four. So the first one is published four months ago it has only 86 views he has only 724 subscribers so if you make a better video you have all the chance to rank it plus you can see his video running here only for 33 seconds so you can beat him theoretically there is only one video who has made this can i take mobile phones and laptops into re rehab similar but again he has 17 subscribers you can beat him six reasons why having your phone in rehab isn't helpful for recovery. There are one or two videos for sure you have to compete with, but still it has a very good potential. Let me check it in 
VidIQ. It's showing 1511 search and the competition is very low. I'll, I'll see it already. What are the related keywords? Rehab, addiction, substance abuse. No. For this kind of keyword, we should not be using addiction or substance abuse because our main target is to rank phones. So you write more about phones and only try to optimize can you have phones in rehab or not. Time to move to our next keyword. Our next keyword is how to prevent eye damage from phones. It has a search volume of 210 from USA and a global volume of 1200. In YouTube search, I'm checking my keywords everywhere where it is showing a search volume of 1600 per month with a decent CPC. Let me see how many videos are targeting this keyword. F. None. None of the videos are targeting this keyword, so it is very good. But remember, all these videos are almost similar. So how, how phone screens damage our eyes, how to prevent eye damage from phones, yes, almost similar. Useful tips how to protect your eyes from mobile screen, almost similar. Three. He is also almost similar, how to provide a blue light, no. So you can expect three or four competition, but still it is a good keyword. Let me check the same now in VidIQ, 1368 search volume. The related keywords here are digital eye strain, blue light, eye strain, smartphone eye damage. You can use all these things in your description. Let's move to our next keyword. The next keyword of today is anti-yellowing phone case, which has a decent search volume of 210, global search volume of 1200. I'm checking now in YouTube search, where it is showing a search volume of 320 a month and a decent CPC. So let me see how many videos are targeting this keyword. Zero out of 10. So there is some videos which is targeting this keyword. One, two, three, I can see it here. So let's count. Okay, one video here, he has not mentioned anything about this keyword in his description, but he has a tag here. The rest of them are all my extensions. So I can see only one or two videos, they are targeting the keyword, but nobody has mentioned this in the title. So go ahead and make a video on that. Now let us see the same in VidIQ. It is showing a 1439 search volume, competition is low, and the related keywords are clear case, iPhone 15, Pro Max case, Apple accessories. You can use all these words in your description. Now time to move to our next keyword. Our next keyword is Apple clear case yellowing which has some search volume from USA, but globally it has also a search volume around 260. I'll check it now in YouTube search, 320, fine. Let me see how many videos are targeting this keyword. Okay, zero out of six. I'm sure nobody is targeting because all will be my extensions, but I will cross check one more time. Yes, I was right. Nobody is targeting this and the related keywords are also not speaking about Apple clear case yellowing. No. So go ahead and make this video. But before that, let me check once in VidIQ. It has a 2,694 search volume. Competition, again, don't bother about competition. No one has targeted this one. What are the related keywords? Related keywords are Apple clear case, case. Yeah, we expected this kind of keywords will be the related keywords. iPhone Pro Max, iPhone clear case. So you are talking about Apple clear case yellowing. So you can talk about uh, different phones case. It can be iPhone 14, it can be iPhone 15. Their case is yellowing and what you can do to prevent it. So you should all you should go for this keyword time for the last keyword for today and it is two phones have lithium batteries which has a good search volume from usa and global search volume is also 300 and above in youtube search it is showing 480 search volume let me see how many videos are targeting this keyword 11 so there are some videos that is targeting this keyword one is here but he has made like a one minute video and that is also not proper video like a vertical video and he has only 1000 subscribers so you can beat him next are all my extensions so i only found one video if you make a better video than him you can be number one if you not you can still be number two let me check the keyword in with iq showing 710 searches per month competition is high but again don't bother about competition you have found something which nobody has targeted yet you have to use all these words in your description lithium ion lithium ion battery battery batteries lithium lithium ion batteries battery life that's fine so these are all the keywords for today and that's how you find the perfect keywords in the tech niche to rank your videos higher and get more views did the video help you did you learn something today if you really found the video helped you out hit the like button and subscribe for more tips on growing your tech channel. Remember, the right keyword is just the foundation for getting your content noticed.